Now we're talking to Mark Westmoreland from Wolfram. Nice to meet you here in uh, Munich on the Finest Spirit. Uh, Mark, you brought something new with you. Um, yeah, we certainly that? have, Bernard. Yeah. Um, I don't know if, if I'll let you know in October when I saw you last in Vienna, but we had been working on our first ever finished whiskey. So this is a five-year-old urban-aged whiskey, and we've also matured it for six months as a port finish as well. And it's absolutely stunning. The batch 155, and again that that helps us get into another part of the market with a finished aged whiskey because it's our first ever and we're very very proud of it and it is flying off the shelves and it's going around the world in our 33 countries that we supply already so it's nice to see it here at Munich. So that was first aged five years in bourbon cask yes. right? And then transferred in a port cask? Yes. Uh, do you know where the port cask came from? Uh, I'm not sure of the provenance but they're port hogsheads as well so again we know it will burn how our spirit reacts and again with a smaller barrel and cask it's right. going to give it just that wee bit more intense flavour and that obviously will burn characteristic that we always have that light fruity floral note and again we mentioned earlier on we're still vibrant and we're still got a very sort of light distillation which makes it a very palatable dram as well right. so uh, you had a lot of releases uh, since you had the first three year old whiskey and have. Yeah, and how do you think the, the spirit developed over the last two years? Um, I think what we're trying to do at Wolfburn, you know, it's the most northerly Highland whisky. Our initial distiller came up from Speyside region. So he had he had the knowledge of the Speyside mob, you know, and it's like a wheel. Yeah. You know, the wheel runs, so you don't try and reinvent it. You might add a different spoke or a different center, but you just want it to keep going. Now, we created a light and vibrant whisky. We had a long fermentation time, which makes it quite fruity. And I suppose over the years, rather than the spirits um, taking on a different character as it ages, we want our DNA to be there from day three, day one, up into where we are now. And we're just over seven years old. We celebrated our seventh birthday on the 25th of January. Um, so we have plans this year to build another couple of warehouses on site. But the spirit itself, for me, I would be... I would be disappointed if our spirit had changed in a way that people would say, well, that's not a recognisable Wolfburn. It's what we want to do at the company. We want Wolfburn to be enjoyed. And in maybe 5, 10, 15 years' time, we want people to pick up a glass and say, that's a Wolfburn. Right. That's the accolade that you always strive for. Um, but yeah, I understand more time in the cask. It's going gonna, it's gonna to give it just a wee bit more flavour. It's going to impart what's been previously in the cask, but for us, it's all about that raw ingredient. It's all about that 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 uh, new make spirit which we make, which you've tasted, and it's very sort of tropical sweet. It's very sort of fruity in nature, and we want that to continue. Right. So, how important is your water to you? It's uh, every part of the process, whether it's the malt, whether it's the water, whether it's um, the cask selection. I think every part of, a, of a, a process is as important as the next. We're lucky with the water that we have, the Wolf Burn water. You know, it was supplying the old distillery in the 1800s, and it supplies us as well. Now, Caithness is Europe's largest peat bog. It's flat, and that adds to the, in my opinion, the flavour of the water because it's natural filtered through the peat and through the sandstone that we have in Caithness as well. The water is very important. It is the water of life after all. It is. So, Mark, thank you for your for your time and the interview. Yep. And enjoy your time here in Munich. Thank you very much, Bernard. Lovely to meet you again. Thank Pleasure. you. Pleasure. Thank you.